Do you need my hammer on? I think, no? No. No. And now we can hear you. Okay, all right, everyone, welcome to the stream. The stream is 90 second delayed. I should actually activate my thing that tells you that the stream is 90 second delay because this is the XTC, the x -Win team championship. Tonight we have the round two, uh, group uh, d, d or E, if I don't, E, I think. Uh, France against Serbia. We have the French Imperials and the Serbian Republic. Um, today with me, uh, co-commenting, because otherwise I would be sad and lonely, is the big boss of the XTC, Filippo! Teamwork makes the dream work! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> yeah, something like that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you didn't expect that, and thank you for having me. Thank you so much for being there. All right. Uh, you know... I, I kind of booked the game two days ago, and then I realized I had my dentist, so <laughs> I, couldn't, I couldn't join in time, but then you saved the day, so... <laughs> and then you could actually join in time, so... Yeah. You got, you got a good, fast dentist. Yes, I pay him way too much. <laughs> well, uh, I'm, I'm, if the people on the stream have seen all my other streams, they might have heard about dentists already, but... Uh, uh, it's my Mexican dentist introduced me to X-Wing. Oh, so I okay. Live, I live in Norway and I, and I broke my tooth while I was on holiday in Finland and on my way home, I was like, okay, I need a dentist. And I typed dentist onto Google Maps and that's the first one that popped like on the map kind of close to where I was. And so I was like, okay, I'm just going to go to them. Like, no idea. And so I go to them and then I realized they're Mexican and you know, that's a bit more lively than the average Norwegian person, more friendly. And uh, outwardly friendly, at least. And, uh, you know, and it's my dentist. And, you know, I have Star Wars t-shirts every now and then. And and one day it starts, you know, anesthetize me and start drilling a bit. And then he, he takes his drill out and like, oh, by the way, I've got a proposal for you. I'll tell you about it when I'm done. Okay. What do you think when your dentist, midway through surgery, is telling you he has a proposal? I don't know, but I've been in rooms like that, except they were much, much darker and much, much scarier. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, my thought immediately was, oh shit, I'm joining the Freemasons. <laughs> Maybe the Illuminatis. Oh, and, well, it's cool being yeah, part of the Illuminatis. Yeah, I mean, you know, could, could be worse. And then he finishes his stuff and then, okay, so... um. I see that uh, you're a bit of a nerd and you have Star Wars t-shirts and uh, so am I. And uh, sometime on Friday, I meet with some friends and we drink a bunch of tequila and we play a Star Wars game. Do you want to join? <laughs> well, if you say Star Wars, if you say game, I'm in. Yeah, and if you say tequila, I'm double in. So, uh, <laughs> turns out good tequila is a thing. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, and it's been five years and, uh, <laughs> and now I'm streaming X-Wing... Uh, professional tournaments so that's uh oh, okay i thought you were gonna go and it's five years i don't touch any tequila so. oh god no no, no that, that that's been plenty of tequilas <laughs> and, oh, and plenty of those nice nice alt alt art cards by our french fella yeah he's bringing uh oh where are they from trying to find on the card if there's some uh oh no they, they have the the french uh emblem and in, uh, instead of the imperial uh, logo on the on the shoulders of, uh, of that's oh, quite very patriotic very patriotic very nice cards very very nice all right so uh maybe we should actually talk about what we are watching uh <laughs> okay if you want i mean also my dentist was fun so <laughs> <laughs> uh people in the chat saying hello hello people in the chat hello <laughs> And so what do we have on the table today? We have six clouds. And Filippo, do you want to tell us everything about the Serbian list? Okay, so the Serbian list is the Republic list. Then we are, have a Obi-Wan Kenobi equipped with calibrated laser targeting. That is not my favorite configuration, I would say. Oh, isn't it? And our five astromech that allows him to spend a charge to repair a face down damage card. So kind of a soft region, I would say, soft repair. Mm -hmm. uh, Obi is accompanied by two 
104th Battalion pilot, that is the generic ARC-170 pilot at initiative 2 and no elite pilot ability. And he's their bestest friend, Warthog, the veteran of Kadavo, if I can read properly. Kadavo, yes. Initiative 3, after you or a friendly non-limited ship at range 02 are destroyed during engagement phase, that ship is not removed until the end of that phase. So, kind of Republic Nash Wind Rider. <laughs> is a Nash Wind Rider the kind of Republic Warthog? Oh, uh, well, dibs on the... Yeah, Republic came first. So, uh -huh. yeah. You see, you see, I was right. Uh, yeah, so that's... Uh... You're not a CLT guy? You're more of a 7B kind of person? Uh, so I suck at X-Wing, so I just get the easiest thing to play. <laughs> well, that's, that's... And three red dice are much easier than having to dodge and put people in your pool size. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. uh, in, in, uh, in the stream, I, I was just playing uh, five minutes ago, ten minutes ago, and uh, I had uh, four uh, CLT Jedi on the board because I love those. That's... That make me so happy. A bit of dancing when you get the bullseye, satisfying. Oh, that that's how I like it. And they're cheap. <laughs> Which so a helps. big this is a big step up for Serbia because we are not seeing any TLT on the board. So <laughs> good old Serbia for <laughs> leaving <laughs> leaving that stereotype. <laughs> Was there a TLT joke with Serbia that I missed at some point? Oh yes. So for kind of two years in a row, everyone. <laughs> the XTC, when playing against Serbia, got a pin saying, I went to the XTC and all I got was this pin and a bunch of TLTs, because they were playing, I think, <laughs> four or five squads that were, like, all heavily TLT, TLT squads. Yeah. Four Rebel, four Rebel uh, Y-Wings, four Rebel Scum Y-Wings. <laughs> Uh, I don't know how many aggressors with TLT, and then Miranda with TLT, and uh, it was just a nightmare. Oof, yeah, that sounds like a nightmare, all right. Uh, yeah, someone in the chat telling me that the uh, the interface was inverted, I, I, I noticed. I, I had expected uh, Quentin to be on the left, and and uh, I've lost my names, uh, Sava to be on, on the right, but uh, they went the other way around, so yeah. But I, yeah, I so you have Sa you have Sava on the left. Sava on the left, yes. Okay, perfect. So yeah. I don't say anything stupid like, yeah, he's going up and he's going the other direction. <laughs> yeah, up, down, you know, it's all relative. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. And so you can also play yourself in the right position. All right. And on the other side of the table, I can uh, I can uh, run through that list. Uh, we have some rather typical Imperial Aces. We have uh, Mr. Darth Vader uh, with fire control system and afterburners. Uh, typical build. We have Sun TFL, rather heavy Sun TFL, with Predator, a shield upgrade, and stealth device. So the uh, Sun TFL, please don't kill me, because I'm worth 72 points. But I got Pretty many dice. Expensive. It's the expensive Sun TFL. Uh, but uh, as uh, the uh, the Norwegian uh, first order player says about Sun TFL, never go out without your stealth device. Oh yeah, agreed. <laughs> and, uh, I, can, I, can, I can get behind that. Uh, and then the third ship is the fifth brother in the TIE V1, uh, Advanced V1, uh, with passive sensors and a homing missile. So the typical move close to me, I'm going to lock you, I'm going to homing missile you, and either you get a lot of dice or you get critted, hit crit. So uh, bad decision or very bad decision. The fifth brother, as we like it. So get rid of him before he shoots you. <laughs> but uh, with the lists on the, the left side of the board, uh, that might be tricky. Oops. But anyway, what's uh, what's your, what's your prediction? Where, where where do you think things will go? Oh, okay. So, Obi by himself does not stand a chance against the Imperial Aces, mainly because of pilot skill and forts, like massive use of forts mm. by Vader and the Fifth Brother. Yeah. Um, there's one thing that goes definitely in uh, Sava's favor. Mm -hmm. That is the beefiness of the arcs. Yeah. I, I think that the arc 170 is maybe not the best, but in the top five of X-Wing chassis, maybe in top three. Definitely top three. Yeah. So, yes, a right. lot of clicking. Yes, Sava, that's because they're doing? starting the clock. Yay! Thank you for calling out my attention.
Uh, did they also? Yeah. Go, 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 go. And I yep. started the clock in the right time, which I didn't for the first three streams I did. Uh, <laughs> but now we're good. All right. And uh, someone in the chat is saying that uh, the Serbian did not bring TLT in Krakow. But in the first ever uh, XTC game between France and Serbia, oh. uh, it was France against TLT Serbia, and they got wrecked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, obviously, <laughs> it, uh, it was obviously uh, first edition. So yeah, yeah, in course. Krakow, we were already playing second edition, so yes, there was no TLT available. <laughs> That's the only reason. But Chad, I do have a question for you. Would you like to see a new incarnation of the TLT? Well, you asked the chat, so I'm not going to say no. <laughs> but I would say no. Uh, I put a prediction. Uh, so until there's uh, dice being rolled, you guys can uh, bet some points. And then you can use your points to play some music and uh, make everyone uh, a bit more deaf. Uh, right now, the, the bids are 10 points towards Serbia and 1,720 points towards France. But if you want free music, I can sing for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I, I actually have some uh, some uh, chillax music playing in the background, some uh, lo-fi uh, Star Wars uh, tunes uh, that you can't hear, uh, Filippo, but uh, but everybody and everybody else can. Supposedly, I bet it's really nice. I never do that because my connection is too bad <laughs> 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 to hold all that upload. <laughs> oh, I, I I used to have something horrible, and then. Well, I had like a okay, like normal, like, you know, a copper cable connection and then had some work done in my house. And then on the way out, the na the, the, the digger just snapped out the, the copper cable. And I called the telecom company and they were like, we're not fixing the copper network anymore. You're going to have to find some other way of getting the internet. Okay, that sucks. I yeah. hope you got fiber, maybe. Yeah, so, so I got... I got link. So I had one year of uh, like a 4G kind of network thingy that somehow wasn't that crazily expensive. Like they basically got a deal for me. And so I had one year of, uh, of 4G and then then I got fiber. And now I'm uh, on a really fast oh, fiber. Oh, and yeah. it's, uh, it's just in time for Corona. I got fiber. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we had a issue because we moved in this house about two years ago okay and for one year and a half the phone company was getting my money but <laughs> they, they were saying that the uh the phone line was non-existing so i was like dude i can like navigate i am paying the bill i'm making phone calls but the line does not exist <laughs> exactly okay that's weird <laughs> then in the end i decided to just get a different operator so <laughs> They would, they would not be able to bump up my speed, so okay. it had to change. I see, I see. Hello there. So, pretty safe approach, I would say, by the French player. Yeah, yeah, so soon tier all the way out there. And the Republic got everything together. So yeah, so yeah, Sunti are ready to get a pin so there. Yeah, but probably both Sunti and, and the brother are going rather quickly straight there to, to get uh, to get two shots. Or maybe the brother trying to like temporize one more round while Sunti uh, continues the grand tour. Yeah. Hmm. And yeah. Yeah, and Vader can just decide what he does once the arc have uh, closed in. The arcs can't, the, the red arc can't really bank there because of the clouds. Well, it would yep, be exactly. tokenless. So so he's kind of forced to go straight, but also he's kind of he can do a one straight, saving another one straight for later. So he's in covered by the gas clouds, yep. or he can decide to go full speed and then catch up with a combined turn mm -hmm. that is red i think i think the can't really remember the dial uh the dial of the i should have pulled the the list there i didn't the arc has the two hard is is white the three hard is red yeah so 
Uh, yeah, he he could manage to. Oh, so one yeah, straight. Okay, so one straight. straight. Yeah. So he is well. yeah getting the the protection of the cloud now, and then the next round are plenty of options. All the banks are an option. Okay, and brother smashing through. Would you, who would you shot for, shoot sorry, first in the Republic squad? Because Obi is a threat, but also Warthog is an enabler for the main mechanic of this squad. Yeah, but at the same time, they're not really able to push so much damage. So I would actually be tempted to try to get the arcs out, and then it's just uh, that there's no more danger on the table. I mean, Obi can wreck you every now and then, but given the matchup... I'm not sure who has initiative, actually. They didn't put the token anywhere, so... Let, let's no, see if Obi-Wan moves first. Token. <laughs> so Obi-Wan moved before... Let me see. Oh, they, 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 they don't have overlaps. It's 46, initiative so, four. Uh, so that's, that's yeah. not going to help us. Uh, so actually, it doesn't matter at all. Uh, yeah, but so, yeah. So Obi-Wan moves after two of the uh, before two of the ships of, of the, the the empire there so it's gonna be a hard time to to fit the bullseye no, I'm, I'm i'm not so sure what's the first target but maybe just getting rid of the arcs to like suddenly be way more uh, free but of course Warthog is is a big uh, i would reasonably say so. that sava has initiative because if I were to play Imperial Aces, I would leave some bid to to then give. Give yeah, but I mean there there's not really much points. I mean Oh uh, yeah. Uh and actually Sava has the the low the highest bid. Sava is one ninety five points and Corentin is one ninety six points. So it's uh, Imperial Aces with oh. basically no bids. Which is you know. Why not? <laughs> I tend to play a Guri with a, at least 11 points Ooh, bid. But... Stop the bets. Stop the oh, bets. Stop the bets. Are being rolled. Stop the bets. Stop the bets. Well, no, no, close. No money's for you. There no money's go. for you. Well, there's a... Uh, <laughs> the, the final bets are 20 points for Serbia and 1,750 points for France. Okay, end of round. Fifth brother used one homing uh, missile and yeah, one homing missile, and then his fort. Uh, sorry, his ability. Yep, and yeah, because uh, yeah, Sava just chose to just take it. So, Not a couple damage. Yeah, yeah. So that's two shields down on the arc that is red, and I'm even going to put them red on the interface. It's a red and it's a yellow. Oops, and it's a red took two shields. Yeah, that, that's that's probably what I would do. I would try to really hurt the arcs before the, there's really engagement starting. I mean, they're not going to be removed from the table if the initiative killed, but... But, you know what, but Sava did a smart choice, because even after the two years, I still think that anyone who allows you to roll dice on a homing missile is just bonkers. <laughs> If you see your opponent allowing you to roll dice on homing missile, you've already won the game. <laughs> I mean, it's it's I'll just take. four dice, and there the, the arc would have had three to defend and a cloud. There's a good yeah, chance still. of taking just one damage, and if you so, took two, that was the same as as uh, as the brother. So, th I mean, the main reason there to like let him do it is that it prevents the brother from doing it again next round. Plus, you have a shield. So you just suck it up on the shield, and there you go. Yeah. Like new. Like new. <laughs> so, yeah, it's... Yeah, the, 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 in that case... I'm, I'm not sure. I might have rolled for it. I might have rolled for it. The brother just had the lock. Yeah, I mean, of course, the thing is, if it actually hits, then the brother can, again, spend the two force, and, and then you really hit. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Tough call. Cool. 
All right. All right. All right. Okay. So what's going to happen now? So I think. Do you think he would go for like the the three hard that are red on the arcs to just like go around the cloud there, or just just going for two, going for banks, trying to to shoot at Vader? Ooh, I think he's gonna go for the two turn, two, two speed turn, two speed turns, and probably yeah. clip the cloud with red, right? Yeah. Which yeah. potentially getting a strain on a one green dice ship is mm -hmm. dangerous. Mm -hmm. It's uh, mostly but honestly, it's losing the focus. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna fit. But... We'll see what he does. I mean, yeah, the, the, the three red hard also <laughs> prevents you from taking a focus. So. Yeah. So it's same, same result. I would go with a two turn to at least close in on something and potentially place a range one and range two shot. Hmm. With the two turn, you don't go much, much forward. No. So there's good chances that you could keep maybe a fifth brother in arc. Yeah. Yeah, and Vader still has both afterburners, so yeah, if you bank, Vader is just gonna get to your side. Yeah. So that's a bad idea. Unless he tries a daring maneuver, and ah oh no, the three turn is red, so he can't battle the wall. No. Huh. That that's gonna be interesting. And then of course you want to keep Warthog nearby pointing at the enemy to to get the the free rerolls there actually there's another thing he could three bank yeah but then i think he's getting super flanked like both vader and the brother and maybe even soon yeah oh. they, one bank okay fair enough yeah that's yeah so one and two bank keeping the formation yeah water getting there to be nearly sure to have arc on 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 the enemy. Something, yeah. To get rerolls if, if that comes up. I'll be maybe a hard turn. Yeah, probably just following the, the group. I, I, it could also go like four straight and, and then maybe even boost to, to keep with the arcs. Oh, reinfor oh, okay, reinforcing front. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, no, no. It was like, nobody's gonna shoot you in the butt. Nope. <laughs> Okay, the brother going there, and yeah, that's that's flanking. There's there's no no shots from yeah. the arc on the brother. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, okay, Obi going forward, probably considering uh, a boost there. Boosts will no not give him a shot on the brother though, and he's close enough. What's the range on Obi Wan? Two, so yeah, he's, he's, he's in range to to use the his power to keep the focuses on on the arcs. Probably just staying there, the right option. What do you think of the lap gunship? Because I struggled a lot playing it. Yeah, it's it's too expensive. Like I would like to be able to fly it, like with. Either three uh, seven B Jedi's or or even four CLT ones or, but yeah, if the basic one was like yeah, if like forty three or or something like that, forty four, then you could have the basic one plus four CLT Jedi, and then that would be a list that would be more than happy to fly, but otherwise, ah, it's so expensive. Uh, I think four of them, like uh, currently the. Basic pilot is like 51 or 52, something like that. Yeah, 51, I think. Correct? Yeah. So, definitely has potential to, I mean, to be oh, it's discounted. 49, the, the, the cheapest pilot. Oh, 49. The generic yeah, is 49. Yeah. 49. Oh, okay. So, I'm going to retract what I'm going to say. Because <laughs> four of them, I'm not going to say... Four of them are scary, but four of them could be a better version of the old four Lambda squad that was kind of running years and years ago. 
why not? Uh, yeah, the Lambda had a three attack die front, right? Oh yeah. And there yeah, it's but just still two. here you, you you have less difficulties because you don't have the necessity to really, really turn around. You can rotate your arcs. Yeah, so true. Yeah, keep your arcs much, much easier. Oh, and actually, 49 point is also the price of a 7B. So you can run three 7Bs and uh, and the lat. Even the... Yeah, makes sense. Not the base. So that, that might be a list I want to fly one day. That makes sense. Yeah. You know, I have issues with generic spam, I gotta say, because I think it kind of makes the game a tiny bit Boring. Boring. Yeah. Uh, I, I do have a kind of a makeshift solution that I hope <laughs> AMG will implement someday. And all it takes is a minor correction in the rules reference. Mm. You know the peeps on the heart to say that one ship is limited yep. or you can have two of them or three of them or whatever. Yeah. They should just add the line saying the peeps, they are only valid in quick build format. Additional limitations are going to be um, issued in the app. Up and hold. You can't have more than two Thai aggressors. You can't have more than two Jedis. Yeah, that, that would you make have, it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you can have countless torrents because they suck. <laughs> but they, I mean, they, they kind of try doing that with uh, like the double and triple uh, uh, generics or the triple dots, uh, double dots in the in the separatist faction. Oh, and we have a, we have a raid. We have forty-seven people that are uh, coming from the X-wing SAG <laughs> channel, and we have now Ooh. ninety-three people <laughs> watching. Hello, everyone. Not oh, uh, uh, meat. Your voice is. It's the Germans. <laughs> it's the Germans. You're being quite, uh, quite mechanical sometimes, robotic even. Oh yeah, sorry. Is the is the line? Yeah, yeah it's. It could be the connection. Yeah, it's not not so great, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, Vader shooting at uh, assume at red. Uh, red, I think he's gonna take two. I'm not sure if it's a an eye or a uh, yeah. No, that was a focus. So spends a focus, and he's thinking about Obi Wan. He's gonna pop the bubble for Obi Wan. Yeah, it's no, no problem. He's in range. Spends Obi Wan's force and can get the focus back. So that's one damage on red. Think that's the last shield. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the chat also says that uh, if you if ah. you if you bring four lats on the on the table, you are paying quite expensive, quite a lot of money for the the lat ability of the rerolls, and you're not able to use it because it doesn't work on uh, on turret shots. That's that's quite true. Yeah, but it's worth trying. I think it's worth trying. Like, it, it wouldn't it be just much worse than just flying for for uh, arcs? Because for lats, mm. you, you don't for lats, you don't yeah. get the 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 ship ability yeah. to work. Yeah, yeah. like yeah, just the arcs would just be much better ships. Yeah, agreed. Agreed. All right, we see the fifth brother there. Oh, the lat took a shield from Suntir. I missed that. And then we have the brother going for three hits into red. Red evades, still takes two hole. And we have points, 21 Good points damage. scored by the French Republic. <laughs> oh, Nickel City X-Wing says that it's like I have my own droid now. <laughs> It's robotic Filippo. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me open the door. I should have a better connection. <laughs> Just one second. <laughs> T 
tower of dice and a good tower of dice and the cloud for the save there it should be a tiny bit better now all right i i hope Wait, it wasn't too bad oh and oh there is a shot from the arc there on the vader that spent all its force but it's still gonna be 3v4 and vader still has the focus laying around oh 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 the arc for three could we see some pain from vader oh ho, 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 that's two hits on vader that's out of shield that's an angry arc 170 pop pop and we are at i guess the end no there's a second shot from the second arc who still has a focus because Ooh, of Kenobi. Tokenless Vader, he doesn't like it. Tokenless Vader. Ah, it's just going to be two with a focus there. Can Vader net you out of this? Yes. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah, he did. I mean, that, that, that would have Lucky been... Lucky Vader. Yeah. I mean, like, shielding out Vader at range three with a focus, that was, <laughs> that was unlucky Vader. So, balance is out, I guess. All right, and we are back back to dials. Hello there. Yeah, the chat agrees with you that yeah, they, they should have like per chassis limitations or like even the generics being limited because yeah, you could get a tie defender at you know sixty four point or sixty three point or something as long as it's limited to just two, it's fine. Yeah, you can have only one or only, only one. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's... They designed a very flexible system, but that's maybe flexible the wrong ways. I don't know <laughs> if it makes sense in like in like th 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 there was yeah. I mean, once they came up with the idea of limited chips and even like double limited, like they were so close to having like this limitation being a, a squad builder change, and they didn't. Like ugh. yeah, but the thing is. Of all, like, I thought that they learned from first edition that the less stuff you print on cards, the better. <laughs> yeah. So they removed points, they removed um, slots. What do you say? The slots, yeah. The upgrade they slots. They removed uh, slots, yes. Mm. And if a named character is fairly obvious that you can have only one, I mean, invent something better maybe for the generics. They just didn't. Maybe later. <laughs> okay. Uh, so now, what what can we do? Vader. Vader probably wants to flee. Probably going to go for a five straight there, trying to avoid getting the arcs again. The brother there is blocking the the hard turns for the arcs. Would they go? Oh, someone's watching some uh, English TV. Oh, yeah, there's Anna in the other room watching something on YouTube. Possibly. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. I told you the, the acoustics in this house are crazy. Yeah, yeah, that's that seems to be uh, very accurate. Yeah, um, yeah. So the arcs, th is it the time for like a four K for the arcs or the whatever K turns they have, or what K turns do they have? They have yeah the four. Yeah, uh, they could just go straight. Go straight. Yeah, shoot at the back next round. Yeah, or even do the like two and three bank respectively for for red and yellow, like being potentially an info Vader and, and some good shot at the back on the on the brother. That probably work. Let's see how it goes. But I mean, going just going straight is a good solution for the arcs. But you know, yeah. Yeah, but uh, I mean, if if they go straight, then then it's going to be harder to turn around. So. I would tend to like start the turnaround like already. Yeah, 
Yeah, open those in the chat says that they, they did the, the double and triple limitation for Droid chips. Yeah, that, that's what I was saying. That, that That's the thing they now kind of did, but it still did in a rigid way. It's like they can't come back and say, oh, actually, the frog prototype or whatever it's called. Uh, you can actually have more of them or less of them. They, they, they made it in a way where it's set in stone. Yeah, but this, this is what I'm suggesting. Like, if it, if they manage to put a simple rat in the rules reference, yeah, and yeah, yeah. you leave on cards, only what you need, the new player might be a tiny bit disoriented. Yeah, but, I, mean, I mean, when you start in X Wing, you're very much disoriented. New player you? status. <laughs> yeah. Yes. So exactly. yeah, like that would work. I would. If you are kind of kind of serious, maybe about the game, you you pick up things fast. So. Yeah. So that's that. That should just work. So it's yeah. Let, let, let's hope that uh, that's something that that comes around. Clearly, AMG there is thinking about like so we're not going to have point change just right now. So maybe they're taking a bit more time and trying to reevaluate uh, things like that. Like uh, maybe uh, maybe some s slight yeah, rules yeah. change like this could be. I mean, yeah, it's only seven months that the new sorry eight months that the news that AMG was taking over. It has gone public, so I assume there was a time where it was non-public. So, or, yeah, okay, fair enough. These things take time, but the fact that we are not getting a point update within the June-July time frame, uh, I don't like it. No, <laughs> I mean, I, I, I was looking forward to it, but yeah. I mean, they, they also still have the excuse that... Uh, there's absolutely no X-Wing tournaments happening right now. We don't have any data. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's no data. I, I, I say without knowing yeah, anything and uh, commenting on a 266-player event. <laughs> oh, no, but more than that, like, it's okay. Nobody can acknowledge what we are actually doing, because at the moment we are just live streaming a phone call between you and me. Yeah, yeah man, uh, that's, n nobody can see anything. But you don't have to say that is because of tournament data. Just say, hey, we realized that the shield two to three years before the time it hit the market maybe is a tiny bit subpar or above the curve. Yeah. For it's actual potential. So, you know what? We're changing this and that. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's, yeah. That, that, yeah. They, they, they could choose to do that. They, for now, have not. We'll see. We'll see how that goes in the, in the near future. But if, if we don't get anything before, yeah, just the autumn, well, then we don't get anything before the autumn. That's a simplified thing for the XTC. If we don't have to think about uh, changing lists and, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah definitely i can't really remember what the captains decided for the break between the group stage and the final stage if i, I don't remember if they have the possibility to resubmit squads in general or, or uh, if it was only for the stuff that would have changed i, I think but the final decision I, was that after the group stage you could just completely change every squad i think yeah someone's gonna I correct don't, us i don't in the remember chat. the decision to be fair but if it's if i decided like if we decided like that i'm really happy that we did <laughs> <laughs> yeah because that's already seven games that everyone's gonna have to play with this and yeah they might have some fatigue especially since they probably played those lists a bit before to to try to to get back onto to those mechanics to make sure that they had anything under control, everything under control. So, yeah. Oh uh, yeah, they are training in between games, so definitely that's definitely a possibility. Yeah, <laughs> I have heard about people uh, getting some some rounds, some 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 test game after the just after the the pairings are done. Okay, I'm gonna meet this and this. 
Which, hey, can somebody play this against me, please? Yeah, I mean, it's fair enough. That's that's not bad, and I mean, and we couldn't enforce it if we if we wanted. So that's that's good. All right, I think the dials are nearly ready. Obi Wan doesn't have a dial yet. That's some uh, some rather slow uh, dials, if you ask me. Yeah. Because yeah. we're moving into round four now. It's been half an hour. Ooh, we have an updated logo for Team USA. Ah, that is going. There oh, that's pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'm going to find a way to share it to uh, to everyone. Uh, save image. USA. Uh, tick, 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 tick. How can I do that? If I do it like this. Uh, 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 there it goes. And to click on. Yeah, sorry, peeps, for the tiny break. I am providing streamers and content creators the updated team logos. So, yes, I'm back. <laughs> There, for everyone, that's a new Team USA uh, logo. And uh, it looks pretty awesome. That was it. And now we see them again. Chewy power following regular stream of followers. All right, and we have movement. We have movement finally. And yeah, so red went for a three bank and yellow for two hard. They're like covering a bit more ground, trying to maybe get a block on the brother if he goes for a for a hard turn. Uh, oh, actually even going for the, for the roll there. Definitely trying to get a block on the brother and then probably getting Obi-Wan to, to be able to get a good shot on the brother. No, the front's not gonna work, it's on the cloud. And going in the middle. The lat turning this way, getting the back arc to, to provide rerolls. Uh, wait, uh, yeah, that was a stressful maneuver there, I assume. And the brother slooping, completely going over the arc. Oh, that's not what uh, Sava was hoping for. <laughs> really not. And again, that's going to be a, a shot on the side of, of yellow there instead of red. But uh, it's going to be a nice, nice shot on the side. Groovy76, welcome. I think I've lost Filippo. No, no, I'm here. No, I'm here. here. Okay. <laughs> just replying to. No, no, I was just replying to a question on the XTC Discord. That, okay. dear viewer, if you haven't joined the XTC Discord server, you totally should. Yeah, <laughs> very much so. <laughs> no. Oh, 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 that's nasty. That's a bumped Sontir. That's still manages to avoid the LAAT attack this way, but still could be subject to a shot from the yellow arc. So Yeah, range three through the cloud into Vader. Or range three through the, the cloud, cloud to Suntier. 
Yeah. Yeah. Uh, bumps uh, bumps on tier is sad on tier. And it's uh it would be a, a shot with rerolls from uh from the lat. Or is is range zero in the arc? Yes it is. Yep. Okay, Vader going for a lock there. Kind of hesitating. Do you go for red to try to get red out as soon as possible, or do you go for the lat? <laughs> Ooh, we can see the hesitation. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 it goes oh. on the lat. Uh, not yet. Yep. Oh, no, 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 it's back on the arc. It's back on the arc. Oh, what can only imagine what this is saying. Oh, and it goes on the, lat. Go on the lat. Go on the lat. Go on the lat. All right. And, oh, yeah, and of course, yeah, Suntia gets a focus from his ability and he can shoot at range three, either through the cloud with the reroll from Predator or not through the cloud onto red. Red is already quite damaged. Maybe it's worth it to try to finish him off. Yeah, yeah. going for it. I don't see any tokens on red. Ho! Oh, boom! Ooh la! Angry Suntier. Really angry. That's going to be a hit crack to stick. That's a sad, sad Mr. Red. Hello there. And that's a weapons failure. Weapons failure. That's uh, that's that's very sad lat there. If he has Arc on Vader, it's not going to be a big shot coming in. I think it's one of the best creep that he could hope to draw. Sorry, is one that's one of the best creeps that Sava, hey, sorry, the French player could Montana. have hoped that the arc draws from. The yeah, arc. like that. That's because really making him very convoluted. Sorry, <laughs> agreed. That's a that's a bad creep to take for an arc. In other words. Okay, so the brother is thinking about his shot. He has range three on the red and the lat, and okay, and he's he's actually gonna roll for the homing missile. Oh yeah, because it would be a oh. dead it, it would be a dead arc otherwise. Yeah, yeah. Like it's probably still a dead arc. Yeah, it is still a dead arc. It's a pretty much a dead arc. Yeah. Tinevé, still the hit crits. That's that's enough. Uh, goodbye, Red. Nice knowing you. So that's now 42 points for Corentin. But I gotta say, at this point, maybe rolling, that's one crit. That's potentially a nasty crit being drawn out of the damage deck. I mm -hmm. know that it still reduces the density of the damage deck, but you know. You access some information by knowing what has been drawn out as that crit goes out. Mm. Right, the lat. Nothing there. Hello there. Xoilar01, thanks for following. <laughs> I was saying with a sad arc and uh, in the chat someone says yeah now it's even sadder it's just some debris in the cloud and he is going for Vader yeah Suntia does have a focus and I'm not sure if it's obstructed it's probably obstructed Oh, Vader Ooh. that would be five dice uh, he doesn't have a focus the arc ah uh, yeah and three nah. of eights and a cloud four <laughs> oh, the, the, the arc went for a barrel which ended up not working out. Uh, and we are back back to dials. So we have one less arc. Uh, the lad still has only one shield down. Vader lost his shield, and that's still all we have. The brother I'll kept the force. Air. Sorry? I'll feel, some, I'll feel some air in the meantime, just to send a shout-out and a lot of kudos to you know all you streamers 
you guys are doing a huge job to let everyone kind of experience the games that are going on. So if you're at home, if you're watching these games, be sure to head to a website, the XTC website, thextc.space. You will find a tab called Streamers. Be sure to head there, check all the streamers that have joined the XTC. If you're a streamer yourself, shoot me an email. You'll be able to join and stream some games and subscribe, activate notifications to every single streamer that has joined the XTC. This is really important for you because you get to see much more games. This is really important for us as the headquarter because we get to stream as many games as possible. But this is really, really, really important for the streamers. So they get views, some of them get to monetize something, and that's really happy because, you know, a tiny bit of money into our favorite hobby brings better content, right? So oh, be sure to head there and subscribe to every single one of them. Yes, do that. Subscribe on we YouTube. Like the money. We like the money. We like the money. The money. No, no, but uh, it's uh, no, it's so. So f follow on 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 Twitch if you don't want to pay, and like you don't have to pay. We don't. It, that's not why we're here. <laughs> uh, but uh, I don't know. I'm running away with all the money from the team enrollments. So <laughs> bye, bye. <laughs> bye bye. I know. Since the start of the XTC, uh, Twitch is uh, now owing me uh, three dollars ninety eight. And they don't pay out until they owe you a hundred dollars. So <laughs> that's really inconvenient. Yeah, that's 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 not. Yeah, that's never coming in. And I think YouTube owes me like thirteen dollars, but that's also never going to cash out because uh, they since changed the rules on uh, how many followers you needed to have, how many subscription you needed to have to be able to monetize. And I fell out of it. So <laughs> I have thirteen dollars that uh, I can't even build upon <laughs> anymore. I'll just let my TV play all your videos like 24-7 for, I don't know, six months. <laughs> Create a bunch of bots to uh, subscribe to my channel so we reach 1,000. <laughs> or you could spend, say, 200 bucks in fake followers. Oh, Jesus so Christ. you can redeem your 13 bucks, I mean. <laughs> oh. Oh, that that sounds no. <laughs> that sounds no. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm here for the community. I'm here for the fun. I'm here for X Wing. I'm here to to spend some nice time with all you guys because that's that's just nice. Uh. All right. What are we gonna see here? Vader is gonna turn in. Do you try to block Vader with a lat? I mean, I guess you try. Yeah. I mean, that would be kind of good even if we are shorter maneuver because you get to keep also arc on something behind. Mm -hmm. Let's see how that yeah. goes. Yeah. Oh, since you uh, gave your speech about following, there's been uh, at least eight new followers. Whoa, eight? <laughs> Yeah, something like that. There's one a few seconds ago, one three minutes, one four minutes, one six minutes, one eight minutes, one nine minutes, one other nine minutes, one eleven minutes ago. It's a constant stream. I think last week I had the, the streaming app like on the side of my of my screen during the day while I was working. And every time someone followed me, I got a notification. And because of people were following like from the XTC website or stuff like that. Like every, you know, 20, 30 minutes, I would get my uh, sound notification saying, hello there, for a new follower. <laughs> that was a wonderful day to work. <laughs> oh, going straight, straight with the lat, trying to keep the maximum arc at the back there. Oh, he's going to rotate. Oh, he's going to rotate. Okay. Really trying to get the rerolls invader. Makes sense. All right, Mr. Brother, banking, trying to get a good shot at Kenobi. Hmm. 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 
Yeah, they are not quite sure what maneuver. I mean, if Kenobi did the one, oh no, yeah, no, <laughs> no more one hard for you, Kenobi. Uh, thinking like in the previous position, one hard and roll would have been good, but yeah, and now that's the one hard bumps. As expected. Okay, and it's gonna be uh, unless Suntia comes by. Yeah, it's never gonna stay there. Just uh, just boosting there for Suntia, getting out of arc. Right, that should. Yeah. Just boost left. Oh, maybe he wants to. <sighs> no, no, he's doing it. He's doing it. There's a shot from the back arc of the arc, but eh, it's through a cloud. Suntia still has the stealth device, so he's fine. Vader, nope. Noping out of there. Bye. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'll come back later to, to clean up. <laughs> Don't want to see you guys. <laughs> what are you doing with all the force? <laughs> Alright, Obi-Wan taking a short range too. He has all the force in the world. 3v3. Spans the focus, hit it crit. And there he goes. <laughs> now that he's out, or at least three paints, no problem, safe. Obi-Wan, Obi-Wan does not have a shot. Oh, but that was very close to something fell. Yeah, but with the... Say, oh, is it worth spending that focus? <laughs> no, no, the, 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 that boost was good. I mean, like, if the one hard had been uh, fully executed there and not bumping on the brother, then I, then I would have soon to get... I think no way to really escape. What's going on here with that Matita? With that pencil? That pencil? Yeah, the <laughs> Sava has did draw something on the on the playmat. Like he picked the wrong tool instead oh. of the hand. He picked the pencil. <laughs> <laughs> drawing on the playmat. I missed it. <laughs> I was looking at the chat. <laughs> uh. I was like, what's going on? Why is he drawing on the playmat? <laughs> Okay, so not going at Vader. One, two, three, four. F is it obstructed? It's five dice, that probably would mean obstructed. Like, I gotta say that even if they had a few very pensive rounds, uh, they're keeping quite a high pace of the game. Yeah, the, the beginning was a bit slow, but then now it's getting a bit better. Oh, Vader! Vader, <laughs> cloud for <laughs> one. Take one card and bleeds. 38 points. Oof. Thank you, Cloud. That would have been a, a bad time there for Vader. Nearly blanking out on five dice. All right. Still an uphill battle. The Republic is like completely spread apart, and that's not what I want to see. They want to be together. Seems like uh, Sava is going to try to chase Vader. Uh, could be, but how much of a sensible option is it? And it's a uh, it's a uh, Vader quite in pain. Yeah, but you're chasing him with a arc and a LA80, so yeah. Eh. yeah. Unless you negate him space and then you actually chase him with Obi, but that means that you are giving your shoulders to fail and the fifth brother. Oh, 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 oh! I have to say in the chat, Flipster, Flipster decided to actually subscribe to me. Giving Ooh. me money. Thank you, Flipster. Flipster, you should not give me money. I should give you money. You're the one who makes everything possible. <laughs> Love you. And yes, you ignorant players who know nothing about X-Wing. X-Wing is a big circle jerking of people who just know each other on the internet. <laughs> not really... Well, actually, um, Fripster is a local of mine, so I do know him in real life. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not true. We, like, I, w I, I think I can say most of us kind of know each other also in real life, be it one tournament or 
10 million. <laughs> there's, I mean, I think in the, the community of people who are playing uh, the, the XTC, there's a lot of people who actually went to the in-person XTC or to the, the other very large events. So there's a network of people who've met in person. More that's so in this event than, than in some of the others. You know, that's one of the strengths of the XTC because it has grown a lot of momentum in 2019. Uh, okay, uh, I don't want to be like, how do you say? Uh, uh, I don't want to pick my own tree, but <laughs> having it side to side with the European Championship was instrumental to its success. I would say to the mutual success of both. Yeah, the, I mean, I don't think anyone who traveled for the XTC didn't also go to the European and maybe the I, other way around. <laughs> you know, like I can literally count one instance of that happening, but just because this player right after the XTC could only play like maybe two rounds in the European Championships and then had to leave because of work. He wasn't planning on playing after two very intense, sorry, three very intense days of XTC. Mm. And he said, oh, okay, I'll just give it a shot and see how it goes, but then have to leave. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's. There's often players that, that come to a tournament and like can't make it to day two and I think that's how I g I've actually got the uh, the, um, the black uh, uh, hyperspace trial uh, dice I was like ninth or whatever the, the, the threshold was or 17th and uh, and one player above me just like no 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 I can't stay and then uh, I grabbed some, some dice that I hate using because you can't read them <laughs> yeah I say 100 sentiment. I'm not a fan of promo dice. Some of them are really, really hard to read. Like yeah. the wa marbled white sparkly ones are the worst. Yeah, and I, I think the, the 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 attack die from the this black series, like the, the the green one, actually quite good. Green on black is quite good, but the dark red on black, ah, uh, literally unreadable. Yeah, no, Agreed. unreadable. Absolutely unreadable. Like if they had put like a, a very light red or something, maybe it would work. But but the the red as as they did it, <laughs> I might as well just roll completely black dice. So it doesn't work. I think worse than those. There's only like, I think it was world's dice in twenty sixteen or seventeen that were white-ish with silver accents. So it was... <laughs> ah, awful. Oof. Yeah, yeah it, it's swag. You can show it to your friends and uh, and say that uh, you won worlds, but uh, you don't want to use those dice. <laughs> Ooh, Suntia coming around. Did he already... No, it didn't take any... Oh, did he roll and boost or something? Oh. Or just boosted? Uh, no, just boosted. I uh, didn't want to, to get stressed. Vader for the turn roll. And not in the arc of the lot. Choosing a front turn roll. Hmm. Really try to get some splash into the lat there. That's still quite a, quite a bit to, to dig through there. Still nine health. The yellow arc is still full. Oh, it is a he did a red maneuver, so there's no no actions there. He could 
put two thrusters, I guess. After burners, sorry. Hmm. So with 20 minutes remaining on the clock. Yeah. Uh, and the, imper the Imperial damage output was much lower than I expected. Yeah, it, it, he played safe for uh, like a lot of the time. All right, range one, Vader. Uh, I don't think he has. Yeah, he does have a lock. He does have a lock on the, on the lat. Yep. So that's that's going to hurt. Yeah. Uh, Suntia was yeah, checking for focus, but no. Oh, okay. Spend the force. Get a crit because of the thing. That's two hit, two crits for the lat. Only one die to defend himself. So that's at least hit, crit, crit. And blank out. Uh, shield, hit, crit, crit. That's, that should be some points. Yeah, it should be a halved. Structural damage, well. <laughs> Ooh. And a few leak. Ooh. Well, it's better in that order than in the other order. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> but it's still, it's a lat that is down to uh, five health, and that bled some point. So now the, the Empire finally has a bit of a headway in points. Okay, now shooting at lat Nomad from Suntir. Two crits. Three dice for the lat because of the cloud. Uh, the, the arc, sorry. Roll, 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 roll. Oh. Uh, cloud for one, uh, focus for two. It's fine. I don't think he has a good shot, so... You could even Obi Wan the focus, but nah, he doesn't have a shot. Nah, just use it. I think he's. Uh, you can see his hand rotating there. He's trying to to see if maybe there's a shot from the Archon Vader, but I, I don't think so. Just spend it. Just spend it. Just spend it. Play safe. Play safe. You don't want that ship dead. Yeah. And I mean, like, what attack is he going to do? Like, uh, a range okay. three through the cloud with a back arc from uh, from the arc? Nah, not going to happen. I mean, might, but no. <laughs> All right. Kenobi, too far. Uh, if your brother, too far. Uh, the lats, too far. Nothing. Not in arc. Yeah, so they are clipping Suntir Woo! range 3 at the back. <laughs> so Suntir is 3, plus 1 for the stealth device, plus 1 for the range, plus 1 for the cloud. That's I a maximum that's dice. Enough. Maximum dice. And a cloud. Did he just not even shoot? <laughs> oh. oh no, he um, rolled a blank and a focus. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he wasn't going to do anything even with double crits, but... All right, so we have the lats... Very much on fire. Oops. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> they did the right thing. They already have all the tokens. Oh, that's lovely. Yes. They even tried to put them a second time. No, no, no. One structural damage is enough structural damage. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Have a bad feeling for the Republic there. What can the lat the lat do? The lat has a ugh, the dial for the lat is kind of painful there because ah uh, the lat could maybe a fast bank a fast bank they have the three bank yeah because I think the, the one for sure bumps the two two bank might actually jumps through. Two bank and rotate the arc uh, the other side again. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Because you're not going to corner Darth Vader. 
No. <laughs> no, so like slowly going around, maybe getting a, like a, a long shot on 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 the brother or on Tuntier. Yeah. Because also Orbi is not in a great position because if he goes slow, then some tear is onto him. Yeah. If he goes fast, then Vader is onto him. Yeah. <laughs> so there's no escape there. <laughs> Yeah, and, and Tuntier for sure goes for a, a too hard to the left there between the clouds. Two banks hit the clouds are too hard and then probably you just boost it to the right. by fixing his position, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, fixes his position by repositioning. Yeah. Either either just a boost or, or, or a barrel boost or something. But yeah, too hard. Too hard boost and then, then maybe something else. But... Uh, that's pretty clear that it's going to be to go able to go around. So, actually, maybe Obi Wan, you two sloop to the left there. Get you get your guns onto Suntier. But then, yeah, then you expose yourself to Vader. I mean, you're getting one shot. So, what would you rather suffer? <laughs> Probably from Suntier. Probably keep your guns on Vader. Try to get yeah. him to bump or something. Because it's more difficult for some tier to keep you in the what do you say in the bullseye rather than Vader having a lock on you. Yeah, <laughs> it's no problem. Uh, so maybe like five k with Obi One, and then like make sure that the lat actually bumps onto Vader, and like kind of closing some doors here. Oof, not sure. I believe in that. I can't remember if the lat has a red stop. Uh, I can check. He does. So maybe stopping could be... But then if you stop, you don't rotate your arc. So, yeah. Or just a one straight, which is not very different from a stop. But of course, that also doesn't rotate. One bank starts to give you a tiny bit of a tilt there. I clearly is uh, debating that. You can see that he's uh, only now starting to set the dial for Obi Wan. Realizing what, what what we've been realizing that you're getting shot in the back by someone, no matter what you do here. And the brother probably just goes fast trying to catch the arc there or me so I'll just quickly reply to fun walk just, just one second I'll be back with you yep sure Some judge call in the exiled. It's a very, very clean game otherwise here for uh, from from Quarantine Sava. No problem. Rules are perfect. Really nice use of uh, tokens and everything. Very clear. Hey, I'll be back in one second. I gotta jump in the other room. Jump, jump. All right, everyone. I'm alone. So alone. Yeah, all right. So it seems that we are finally ready there. There's a ping on the table. Let's see, let's see. We're gonna have to start with the arc there. Too hard onto the cloud, trying to catch Vader no matter what. Uh, rolling for the cloud. There's a corner there that's out of the cloud, so probably not gonna be an obstructed shot, but ah, uh, gets, gets the strain. Schematic, let's go, Quentin. Yeah, I think, I think, Quentin is, uh, is let's go. <laughs> that's, uh, that sounds quite 
clear to me there. Uh, and the zero stop for the for the lads. All right, brother. Yeah, just going fast, trying to to catch the arc in the back. Boosting focus. Yeah, it's gonna be still probably still gonna be range three there, but it's a strain arc, so not not much defense. He has all the force in the world. Okay, two straight for your one choosing to get shot by Suntier. Apparently, uh, could maybe roll to the right there to make it harder for Suntier to actually boost back in. That's probably one of the potential calls but losing any hope of getting a bullseye on onto vader but i think anyway there's not much hope vader is out of uh, afterburners so not so much reposition but the roll can often take you out of the, of the bullseye there given the the kind of angles they're going to be at so choice of action there for Obi Wan. That could that could be life or death, of either him or Vader. And I am back. You're back. Some uh, I'm movement not have happened. The table yet? I'll be back soon. Yeah. There's a, we have an arc on a cloud. We have a brother in a hot pursuit, and we have an Obi Wan who's really wondering what the hell he should do. I am blind. I can't see. You can see. Not in the Damn it. No. tabletop simulator. <laughs> Damn it, tabletop simulator. Still uh, 69 to 38 there with only uh, 8 minutes on the clock. Yes, the table clock agrees with the stream clock. Uh, that's that's going to be... That's going to be a hard end of game here. Or and I am back. So you are back. Yeah, I heard the bloop. Bloop. <laughs> bloop. I blooped into bloop. the table. Bloop. Okay, and Obi-Wan going for the roll there. Trying to make it hard for Suntia to boost back into him. I think that's, that's the idea. I think it's nearly impossible for Suntia to get too hard boo uh -huh. no he, won he wouldn't get a, at least not a bullseye okay yeah so roll focus and Suntia actually does not go for the too hard it just goes oh that's good because now you can roll to the left there and get a pretty good shot on Obi-Wan is that Ooh. the call spicy situation Oh no, he goes the completely the other way. Okay. Just 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 wants to make me wrong. <laughs> Alright. But he goes he goes this way. That's that's a bullseye on the on the arc there. And Vader zoops just Ooh, skimming out. Good. Uh actually it's a pretty bad position for Vader now because he's not gonna be able to get a shot at anything. And he's getting shot by both the arc and Obi. Oh, and there was not even a blue maneuver. Uh, uh, yeah, the three bank is not even a blue maneuver, so he's still stressed there. Ah. Yeah, so he's getting yeah. a triple shot there. And so oh, yeah, he's getting a range one by, by the lot. By the lot, yeah. That. Everyone shoots at Vader, and Vader only has two hole left. No tokens whoa, except for us. Whoa, just one second. Blue modified. Just to hit while rolling. Oh, just one second. Well, uh, where are they playing? Jeez, where are they playing? Oh, there, here they are. Yep. The chat here says uh, warning blue modified dice while rolling, so not sure exactly what happened, but. It would appear that uh, Corentin might have uh, clicked something wrong. So they're going to re-roll. They're going to just re-roll the... Oh, 
Okay, there's some explanation going on. I think Filippo will just explain to us what's up. And the clock is back up. Oh yeah, so um, so what happened is that um, the French player hit modify yeah. to modify his eyes a bit too early, and that that uh, triggered the warning. generated an error in the log. So okay. if you look at the chat, it was like blue player modified mm. this while rolling, but he has a mod, so okay, just told him like. Right. Do not hastily push buttons. Okay. Ooh, it's a direct. Oh, direct hit! Pop, pop, pop! Goodbye, Mr. Vader. There. Rolling a bit too many blanks. Pop, 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 Vader. That's actually right now uh, twisting the the score. Uh, even with a three shield on the arc. The brother's gonna need to make some damage. Uh, just one. The arc rolling nothing. Brother spending two force there to add a crit. Hit. And there it goes. Hit crit on the arc, and the points are back, and the game is back into the hands of Corentin. But to roll damage. Circling. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Yeah, but like suddenly the game kind of. Turn into a position where where things could be possible. Ah, it's only four minutes left. Suntia and the brother are completely full health with with still all their things. At least the, the stealth device is still there. No, that that was that was really good to to hit Vader there, but it's not just not going to be enough. There's a really good shot from Kenobi. F's in the chat for the direct hit on Vader. Yeah, but for the moment, like he traded Vader for uh, one arc, and I would say the lat. Yeah, kind pretty of. much. Yeah, and uh, half of the other lats. Yeah, half of the other lat. So yeah, solid. Oh. <laughs> Flipster is uh, <laughs> playing the sad flute on the stream. We can't hear it, but everyone, uh, I think, heard it. If, if things are all right. It's a bit weird with uh, the stream delay. I think they're actually going to hear it in, in, in a minute and a half. <laughs> all right, soon tier, four dice. It's it's uh, not happy soon tier, but it's uh, alive soon tier, no problem. Don't even need to spend focus. All right, that's gonna be a tough, tough, tough end of game for for Sava here. The points don't necessarily reflect that with a ninety to seventy-five current score, but I'm afraid that this arc doesn't have much life in it. It's gonna go through the cloud again next round, potentially get uh, strained again. Definitely yeah, no actions. It, it, already, it already has the uh, structural, structural damage. damage. Yeah. So yeah, but so even at range three, we still get zero dice. <laughs> Not fun. Not fun. No, that's that's going to be a very poor arc. He has four hull left, if my math is correct. Yeah, and uh, yeah, so both warthog and uh, yeah, both 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 ships are both the arc and the lat have uh, structural damage. Oh, there's been some uh, <laughs> extra flipping there. Suddenly, uh, Watog lost both his charges. They're going to fix it. If that ever turns out to be something to think about. Yeah, they're fixing it. Yeah, so the, the lat is uh, stressed now because it stopped the last round, if if I remember. At least it should be stressed. What what is blue on the lat? Not very much. One straight, two straight. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Still has a few leak. That's uh, it doesn't want to be hit by anything, and there's two ships in hot pursuit.
where the field was invaded by the puppy who really wants to go out. <laughs> <laughs> well, that happens. She's like, bring me outside, need to do the walkies. keys. Ooh, and do we have the timer kicking time there? The yeah, that's... Uh, that's gonna be complicated there for, for Sava to take anything. Whereas for, for Corentin, killing either the lats or the or the arc would be probably rather easy picking. Right, some uh, some thoughts about the dials there. How do you get Suntia the most damaging? At the same time, he's going to have to jump over Suntia with the brother, so probably a two bank or something. Suntia should just go, I don't know, two straight and, and see where people are by the time that happens, probably. the arc bumping and getting the strain the lats going for a what looks like a two bank stay stressed only the one and the two straight are blue um, three bank three bank i think three bank yeah yep Yeah, but the problem is that now money is in the bank. Like, yeah, the lat is not gonna have much of an impact. I'll be, yeah, I'll be good. Blue, try a range. Ah, that's important. <laughs> Hitting the cloud there, getting straight. That's very unfortunate indeed. Uh, yeah, that's that's really unfortunate because no shot. I mean, daring maneuver. Kudos to Sava for trying that. Oh, so until going for two bank there. Do you boost to kill the lat boost there? In, maybe. Yeah, boost in to heal the lat. Yeah. Make sure that it's not OB worth. Can you. Con yeah, I mean, it's not worth confronting Obi's die. Nah, no. <laughs> it could roll. Also, the lat could mm. be. Oh, sorry, I cut you off. No, no, it's okay. The, I mean, the, the lat is, I think, rather easy to, to take down. There's only. If, um, there's no dice and four. Okay. Oh, okay. He goes for. Uh, I mean, yeah, if he doesn't die Safe. now, he wins the game. He doesn't choose violence, he chooses to win. <laughs> Which, you know, yeah. fair enough. Uh, that's a range three, not obstructed. Not but obstructed. Two versus four dice, there's an evade token hit crit there. Yeah, I mean, even if it, everything goes through and he won't, there's an evade token and a force. Uh, that would just be the shields, that would just be. Well, actually, that would be half points. That would hurt. 
All right, <laughs> range three into soon here. Uh, obstructed, yeah, so all the dice. One hit. <laughs> soon here, all the eyes. No, no problem. Four evades. Plus an yeah, evade token. Yeah, we a cloud, so. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and no shots there. And, and no shot. Oh, oh, no, they have to reroll the soon here. That should only have been five dice. Why? There's a stress token on soon here. Yeah, so what? <laughs> He got it from a uh, evade boosting. No, I think that's uh, that's that's game uh, ninety to seventy five. Yep. Even if it seemed that uh, the the Quentin and the, the Imperial player had much more of a, of a lead than 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 he had, uh, but uh, yeah, that uh, that was a, that was a good game. That was exciting. That was a good approach there. And then then the Imperial uh, shown violence and. As uh, the people in the chat had uh, bet, uh, that's that's a victory for uh, for France for the French Imperials. Congrats, uh, Quentin, uh, and uh, thank you for playing Sava, and thank you, uh, Filippo, of course, for being with me. Otherwise, I would have been very sad and lonely. So thank you, lonely. thank you for having me. Would like to hello there. send you the invite to join. Oh, who's who's there? Who's there? Hello there. There was a hello it's there. The Empire who coming for you. <laughs> the Empire coming for me. Well, <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I'm the big too. But uh, c congratulations for uh, f for your victory. That was uh, that was really nicely played. At the end there, I, I thought you would just uh, go choose violence and uh, and kill something. But of course, that's that's the way I play and that's the way I lose games. <laughs> <laughs> There's no need. I, I've got points. Yeah, uh, yeah. I think about uh, make a two straight and by roll take a, try to take the arc with no defense dice. Mm -hmm. But the better way is just I've got points. Take evade. Yeah, yeah. Just... Uh, if Obi Wan don't have three dice, he can't put half on the fifth. Yeah. So just keep evade and you are sure to survive uh, this shot. Yeah, absolutely. That that was that was exactly what. Uh, but Vader, seriously, Vader, he make he take uh, air. Three dice uh, defense. Oh yeah, yeah like <laughs> all the way two down blanks. there. <laughs> uh, here, he take two blanks. No, three blanks. Sorry. <laughs> and here, he take he take against uh, two blank. Yeah, he that. Make too uh, much blank for survive. Yeah, that was that was a pretty bad Vader. All right, I'm going yeah, to I'm uh, stop the stream and we can continue chatting in, in private. But uh, thank you everyone for joining the stream. Thank you for following and subscribing. And there will be more streams. They, there's there's some streams tomorrow. Yes, at yes. least one at uh, the very very yeah. soon. Thank you for playing. Ciao 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 ciao. ciao. ciao.